Hi everyone and welcome back to my channel. My name's Jonna and uh, I'm sitting outside the Walgreens. Now, I first want to say Happy Mother's Day. If you're seeing this on Mother's Day or if you're seeing it after Mother's Day, I hope you had a great day. And uh, I'm gonna run in here and do some great deals. Now we're expecting some thunder showers, so I hope I don't get caught in that. But um, I didn't get a spend booster all week. And last night before I went to bed, I checked my account and I had a new spend booster of spend 25, get 10. So I'm excited to go in here and do some awesome deals. If you are new to my channel, welcome. I do appreciate you stopping by. And if you're coming back for a visit, well, you know I appreciate you. We're gonna run in here and get some awesome deals. So I'll let you know what I get when I come back out to the car. All right, you guys, let's go. Okay, I'm gonna go find a place to park that I'm not in front of the store here because I, I gotta tell you what happened. This is insane. All right, hang on. Hopefully my phone doesn't fall. All right, so I originally went in and I got a Airwick because they're 12, you know, they raised them up to $18, $18.99 for the Airwick starter kit. And they had lowered it with the My Walgreens. You can get it for 12 and change. And I could have sworn I checked this morning and I had $6 coming back from my Ibotta. And then I was going to get a $5 coupon on it. So I was going to get it for 7 get 6 back. It was going to take care of $6 of my Walgreens or my uh, Ibotta. Sorry, I had to put my hair up. Okay, so yada yada. I got that and I got the... Um, head and shoulders deal. We get $4 in Walgreens register reward when you purchase two. So I had to go in, I had to unclip a lot of lower coupons I had to be able to use the $5 off coupon. Anyway, my order came to $16 and I used $10 in Walgreens cash. Then when I got out to the car and it didn't pick up the Airwick, um, I couldn't find the Airwick even in my list on Ibotta. So I thought, well, I'm not going to buy $7 for this when I get these things free. And then I was thinking, I never, and I even asked the guy about my register reward. I go, hey, is your Catalina machine not working? And he put the, the paper feed and he goes, oh, no, it's working. And I go, well, you know, I think I was supposed to get a reward. So when I got to the car, I double checked. I thought, well, maybe I got the wrong head and shoulders. No, I got the right head and shoulders. So I took it back in, I exchanged it all. I didn't save my receipt. She, I told her she could have it because I wasn't keeping any items on it. I used $10 in Walgreens cash and $6. Well, somehow she gave me $26 back on a, on a uh, card. And, um, so I got like an extra ten dollars. I, she was gonna put what I spent on my card and put the ten dollars Walgreens cash on here because I go well, you know, I used some Walgreens cash. She put twenty six dollars on here, so that's like an extra ten dollars. So I went and I, I don't know, this is crazy. I went back and I got the Nexus, okay? These are $16 on special, but instead of getting two of these, cause you have to, okay, on the Nexus, you spend 25, get a $10 register reward. There's $8 off two. These are on sale instead of $17.99, these are 16, which means you have to buy two of these to hit 32, to get your eight off, you know, and you got to hit that 25 to get the 10. So instead of getting two of these, um, I got the conditioner, which is a higher value for 16. And I got, they had some of these. And this was 11 and change. And that is, uh, uh, they had a detangler spray for 11.99 and they had a styling gel. And then they had this, this is, uh, blow dry balm okay 
so it's going to help not be frizzy or whatever you get when you blow dry your hair okay so i got those two 11.99 or 12 dollars and 16 came to what 28 28 28 or 27.99 i had an $8 off coupon brought it down to 19.99 to and change in tax my total was 22 so i put it on that card i had 26 dollars i still have like four dollars on that card now mind you I'm only out of pocket six cash and ten dollar register or ten dollars Walgreens cash. So I don't know what happened. So mind you, I had a spend booster. So I was doing this. I was thinking I was gonna get my ten dollars for the Nexus and $10 in um, <laughs> Spin Booster. We didn't get the Spin Booster because the money on the card is like Walgreens cash. Even though part of it was cash out of pocket, mind you now, I had 10 extra dollars on that card somehow. Um, so I called customer service, they go, well ma'am, the card you had, uh, ten dollars in Walgreens cash and I go well yeah but I did spend some regular cash too and I had to put everything on the card and I go well it's no big deal I'll use the spend booster another time because it dawns on me okay well I'm not gonna get a spend booster I got ten dollars Walgreens cash that was mine and then I also got um an extra ten dollars so it's like I got the booster already so I still have my booster I have to do, but let me show you this. Is this crazy? Okay, so really, I've spent bottom line $16, 10 in Walgreens cash, six in my own cash, 16. And I got back 10. That means I've spent Six and I got four still on that card means I spent two for these Nexus products and I still have my spin booster to go get some other stuff so here's what I got the Nexus for 16 the blow dry for $11.99 $8 manufacturer coupon made it 19 store credit and I got back that ten dollars so getting that ten dollars back is like getting my Walgreens cash back okay so I got my ten dollars and then I still have four and I spent six so it means I've spent two out of two dollars and I got that Nexus and I still have my spin booster so if I get use that 10 to get my spin booster, now um, I'll have 10 more dollars. I feel bad, I got an extra 10 on that card. I don't know what happened. It didn't dawn on me at first and then she put $26 on there. I thought, well, I spent 10 in Walgreens cash and six in my own money. That's only 16, it's like I got an extra 10. Um, I don't know. Anyway, I wasn't going to go back in with this Nexus. Now I told the guy, I go, well, I'm not going to go back in. I don't know what happened. I said, um, had I known that, I just would have paid with cash. Because I got the Nexus. Yeah, there was the $10 and the $8 coupon. So that's 18 And I spent 27 So it cost me 10 But I got that extra 10 so it didn't cost me anything. And I really was going to use my spin booster. So it, wasn't, it was only going to cost me like couple dollars anyway but I needed the Nexus so I'm glad I got it I think I'm gonna go to a different Walgreens and I'll bring you what I get there because there's still more stuff I want to get um, I do want to get the shampoo because there is a uh, rebate for it and um, 
I do have a couple coupons. I want to get the crest that's free. And I think I want to get some Tide Simply. So I'm going to go to another Walgreens. Let's see what I can get. And i got to hurry up and get this video to you guys. So you can get out and do your deals. All right, you guys. I'll be back. Okay, you guys. Let me turn this air down. It's hot. I mean, I know we have thunderstorms, but it's 90-something and humid because of the, you know. Anyway, I'm out of the Walgreens for the second time. Well, actually more than the second time. I had to go back in the first time. So anyway, this didn't go perfectly well either. Okay, so I did the um, Pearl B. We have a $3 digital coupon. These are $3 a piece. When you buy two, get a $3 register reward. So I got two, I always get the soft, and these are the Bacterial Blast, but they had other ones there. Okay, I got this first so I could get back my register reward to put it with my next item. I also got a 20% off that I did not use because I was gonna use a spin booster and I wanted to make sure it didn't screw up this time. So, I had that $10 Unilever from the Nexus that I just did, and I had the $3 from the toothbrushes that I just got. I had a $3 that I got last week. They're all manufacturer coupons. I was lucky enough to find some of these. $2 off X. Um, I got a couple extra. I actually have two more than I wanted because, or one more. I used, it says you can use two. Now I bought four X products, but since they were going to give back a register reward or $5 in Walgreens cash when you buy four, there's also a $2 rebate on Ibotta. And this is the one I got. Uh, there's different scents. I got all the same scent. I used two of the coupons because it says you can use two. But I also had that $10 Unilever. So, um, and these are different sizes, but they're the same fluid ounces. But I think they're just packaged different now or something. I don't know. Anyway, I got those. And they are on a buy one, get one half. So two of them are gonna ring up at $7.49 and two of them are gonna ring up at $3.74. So basically you're gonna pay for three and you're gonna get four. That came to a total of like $22.50. So I still needed to spend money to get my booster. So I had a Revlon coupon for um, $3 back when you purchase a Revlon tool. So I got the Emery boards. These were $3.79 and I got $3 back. So I got these for 79 cents. And then I had a coupon I had a digital and I had a paper that had printed out last week when I bought something. So I got another one. These were $3.29. They're the baby clippers. And um, I got $3 off, so I got these for 29 cents. Now, I gave her a $3. I gave her two of the $2 peelies that I found. There's a pad right there, so look by your X. There's also a dollar uh, coupon for Dove, which I didn't take any of. But the X, I have about five extra. Okay, so it's two dollars off of one. And I bought it as giving me two dollars back on each one. 
And when I spend 20, I got $5 back in Walgreens cash. So I had that Unilever $10. I used the $10, I used two $3 manufacturer coupons I had, that's 16. Then I had a $3 off the Revlon, that's 19. And I had two of those, um, I had two of these Axe. So she gave me back a Revlon and an Axe. She said two of my coupons wouldn't go through. I don't think, I don't think this was the one that wouldn't go through because it says I have two Revlon on there. One's a digital and one's a paper, but that's okay. I got it back. I'll get some more Emery boards for 29 cents. I don't know. And I got that Axe back and we know that we buy a lot of Axe because there's always pretty good deals on it. So, that being said, I got out to the car to put my rebates in for the Axe to get my $8 back. Oh, and my total came to 16 with tax, 13 before tax. And I go, well, that seems a little high because I was thinking it was gonna be like six bucks or four bucks even and I'm thinking well maybe it's because of the coupons I got back or whatever so I paid the 16 when I got out to the car I noticed that she had rang up five acts instead of four so I got charged an extra axe but the bad thing is too it was full price so because they're you know I got two half price and two full price and then the fifth one was another full price so I had to go back in and get that back so I will show you my receipt for getting that back and I will deduct this eight dollars and fourteen cents and she put that back on my card and then that brought my total to eight dollars Um, well, it was 13 before the tax and eight coming back. So it brought it to five. Those two coupons wouldn't go through. Okay. Or it would have been zero, just tax. So here is my receipt. There is the X. Buy one, get one half. Buy one, get one half. There is the nail clippers. There is the extra axe that I didn't get. And then there are the Emery boards. I have the $10 Unilever coupon I just got from the Nexus. $3 off the Emery board. $3 off uh, my paper coupon. Another three paper coupon. And then manufacturer coupon. Oh, I had a $2. That is the axe pulley coupon. And I had a $3 off digital on the tools for Revlon. Okay, so that's what I had off. She handed me back a three and a two. I also, when I scanned this receipt to Ibotta, they picked up that extra act. So I got $10 instead of eight back. I'm making money. I mean, I'm not trying to make this money, but you know, um, and I don't know if they'll pick up a return or, I don't know how that works. I've never, I've never really returned anything or if I have, it hasn't been something where I've used the receipt for a rebate. So I don't know how that works, but I got an extra $2. Figure it's the coupon I didn't get to use, right? All right, so. I got that $8 back on the card. So, so far today, oh, and I got the, um, I got the $5 in earn this visit. I got my $10 booster for $10 for spending 25 and I got the $5 for the ax. So I got $15 in Walgreens cash. 
I paid 16 with the tax. So that's a dollar, but then I got the eight back, which makes it seven, and then I got 10 back from my bottom. So that's like a $17 moneymaker or something. I don't know. When all is said and done, what I put on my card today was eight and is $14 I put on my card today. My personal bank account, PayPal, what have you. I put $14. I got back from my Ibotta the ten dollars now i wanted to go back in i may go to a different walgreens because i do want to get some paper products with my walgreens cash or maybe i'll just save it for next week because i know that the Continental's is 4.99 this week and then the in aviva are 4.99 again and the walgreens toilet paper is a dollar 99 and you know, stock up on that stuff while you can, but stock up on some paper products. Um, I won't put that in the video because you guys already know about that deal. $4.99 on Viva, $4.99 on Continental, the four pack of the Mega Rolls, and then $1.99 on the Walgreens toilet paper, which is pretty good. Toilet paper, $1.99 a four pack. Other than that, you guys, I hope you're having a great Mother's Day. I got a couple extra gifts today, I guess. I don't know. Um, I didn't set out to get them and I almost kind of feel guilty. Um, I hope it doesn't cause any havoc for anyone. But that being said, I hope you're having a great Mother's Day and I think I'm gonna run by CBS. And I'll see you in the next one. Happy shopping, everyone.